safe memory. So I, I like all the levels really. I do. Just some are very frustrating. I think this one is as well. Then again, we are now in World Four. We're playing with the big boys, as it were. Four out of six, you know. Yeah. Mmm, honey, honey. That's an Abba song, isn't it? Honey, honey, how I missed you. Uh -huh. Honey, honey. I remember I might get that to, uh, I might add that to the soundtrack of this later on. But am I doing that? Yeah, that was funny, wasn't it? It's worse than trying to climb up one of these things. Climbing down without hitting a zinger or falling too far. <sighs> this video, you just gotta climb your way back up again. Ha <sighs> <sighs> ha! I missed. Get a cartwheel trick there. <sighs> Let's get a going. What's over here? Ooh, the DK coin. Now, since this level is called uh, Ram by Rumble, it is actually essential to become Ram by. Let's go. Even though it only gets half a level, despite the fact his name's in the level. Let's go. See, obviously I know what's coming. It's where we also get some really awesome music. That's right, we're being chased by the boss. No! See, there he goes. Well, you are in his beehive. You are in the beehive, you gotta remember that. I think I can probably do slightly better this time. We got the DK coin and everything, so let's just go. And before you say anything, yes, it is impossible to do this part without him. You've seen the amount of zingers and red zingers and stuff. You can't do this as the Kongs. It's forcing you. That was clever. I'm in big trouble now. Big trouble in Crazy Kremlin. See what I mean about the music, though. Music is awesome for that. And now it's time for the boss. Let's see how we get on. Alright, sorry if there's a slight sort of jump in audio and animation and stuff. Uh, it's because my camcorder battery um, actually ran out and I quite like to finish the world before I stop properly for the time being so uh, off to the bus King Zing Sting we've just met him now you get to fight him 
And this is the first time that you get to fight a boss as an animal friend. And it won't be the last. Let's go. Even though it's tricky and can be quite frustrating, this boss is actually immense fun to play against. It's a boss that's got a lot of replay value. Which you find with the Donkey Kong games, whether it be the Countries or Donkey Kong 64 as well. If you disagree with me, that's fine, but I think so. That is, uh, in terms of difficulty and strategy and the way it's done, he's certainly an improvement over the, uh, uh, his equivalent in Donkey Kong Country 1. That's just not fair. Let's get some space. No! Ooh, one life left. Okay, let's cut it down to the wire. Down to the wire. Let's get this SOB. Okay, this is not going to end well. Whoa, whoa, that was a sweet shot. That, on the other hand, I saw coming a mile off. Are we going to get the first game over? Are we going to get it? Can't it wait? Give us a little reprieve there. Well, come on, Squawks. Don't be a retard. Don't let me turn you into a retard, please. You're too cool. After he shrinks, it would be easier. And then again, he is a boss, so. Uh... Gotcha. Let's see what you're made of. Mano a mano. And. Gotcha! Gotcha, you bee. Yeah! This is where... Well, four over. Took a bit longer than I'd hoped. And Gloomy Gulch awaits us. Let's see what happens, eh?